CASA XPS is downloaded from the web as a zip file. The zip file contains the executable and a set of configuration files. Place the zip file in a directory and extract all the files within the zip file. A new directory will be created and the new directory will contain these configuration files which must be located where the executable is located in terms of a directory so create a shortcut and move the shortcut to the desktop rather than the executable when you start CASA XPS the file CASA XPS.lib is automatically loaded for the default element library if you move the executable then this connection will be lost so the shortcut should be placed on the desktop and when you start CASA via the shortcut the main window will appear and if your PC is already licensed for CASA XPS then you will see that the title bar shows you the username that was used to license this version and this copy of CASA XPS. One of the changes in this version of CASA XPS is the font sizes are now described using a metric system. As a result some of the fonts may appear unduly small so there is a, a new option on the global property page of CASA XPS which will allow you to alter the selected font size for all of the fonts you can also adjust them individually but this allows you to set a new set of fonts and then save as the current default